If you're looking for a pan and tilt zoom camera that has a lot of features, including AI detection, then the Eufy S340 might be your best bet. Eufy Security just sent me this camera to review. This is the S340, which is a pan tilt zoom camera, and it's also powered by solar, which is a combination I've never seen before. Eufy did send me this camera for review, but with all my review videos, I wanna make sure you have accurate and honest information, so that way you can make a decision that's best for you. The Eufy S340 is a solar powered pan tilt zoom camera with AI tracking and dual lenses. Not only is that a mouthful, but it's a lot of features to pack into a completely wireless camera. And while this camera isn't 4K, the dual lens feature more than makes up for it. It has a 135 degree wide angle lens that records in 3K and an eight times hybrid lens that records in 2K. So this lets you keep track of everything from deliveries to your kids with clarity especially when you combine this with the dual view feature so that you can see everything all at the same time. And if you think about it, a lot of times the only reason we want 4K cameras is to pick up small details that are far away, which is exactly what the telephoto lens is designed to do. This camera has another feature called Forever Power that requires just two hours of daily sun in order to keep the camera charged. And it has Solar Plus that lets the solar panel work with a relatively low amount of sunlight. And it has a built-in 10,000 milliamp hour battery that will power the camera for up to four months. That means you can install this camera in places that you wouldn't normally be able to, even if the spot you chose doesn't get full sun all day, or if you live in a climate that's more cloudy than it is sunny throughout the year. You have two different options to mount the solar panel too. You can either mount the panel on the top of the S340 camera, keeping everything together, or you can install the panel in another location and connect the two with the included power cable. Those two things combined makes this the most flexible wireless camera I've ever reviewed. The camera can work with Eufy's Homebase 3 for additional storage, but unlike some Eufy cameras, it doesn't require the Homebase 3 in order for it to work. Now, if you do want to pair it with the Homebase 3, that will add more storage for your video files, up to a whopping 16 terabytes. But if not, the camera does include storage and it has eight gigabytes of onboard storage that it can use for video. No matter what option you choose though, your videos are stored locally with advanced encryption to protect your privacy. And because your videos are saved to local file storage, that means there are no subscription charges or hidden monthly fees. The camera has built-in AI that can detect, recognize, and track humans, vehicles, or both. It'll even let you know what type of motion was detected when you get an alert through your smartphone. And speaking of tracking, the S340 is a true pan tilt zoom camera with 360 degrees of coverage. This is called the 360 degree guardian by Eufy, and this feature can totally eliminate blind spots, no matter how big of an area you want to cover. Also, if you're finding this video helpful so far, be sure to hit the like button and also consider subscribing to the channel if you haven't already for more content just like this. All right, so let's look at the S340 up close. So this camera is really compact considering the size of the solar panel and the features that it includes. And it includes a camera mount that can be installed in two different ways. You can either wall mount the camera or mount the camera under another surface like an Eve. Now speaking of cameras, there are actually two different cameras or more specifically two different camera lenses. One is a 3K camera lens that is a wide angle lens and the other one is a 2K eight times zoom telephoto lens. And that telephoto lens allows you to get really, really detailed views of things that are far away. There's also a 100 lumen LED light on the front and a motion sensor to track everything as well. So the other cool thing about this camera is not only can you review it with video, with a wide angle and also a zoomed in lens, it can also follow you around as you move or as someone else moves along your property, and it can even pick up sound so you can hear what's going on. And it can even let you have a two-way conversation. Test one, two, three. Or sound an alarm if it's required. The solar panel is nice and compact, and it comes with a mount that can be used to install the panel either to the top of the camera, or it can be installed separately with the included 10-foot power cord. Eufy also includes everything else you need to install and power up your camera, except for the tools. To set everything up, start with installing the Eufy Security app as the first step if you don't already have it on your smartphone or tablet. After that, it's just a matter of following the directions that come with the camera, or you can use the step-by-step -step instructions in the app itself. And that being said, the basic process to get everything set up is to charge the camera fully by using the built-in USB-C port. Then it's as simple as connecting the camera to your network by using the app. Now keep in mind, if you want to connect the camera to a Homebase 3, you'll need to have both the camera and the Homebase close together to get everything synced. After the camera is fully charged and connected, you can use the included template to mark the location where you'll install the mount. And if you're installing the camera separately from the solar panel, you'll need to mark that location too. To install, you'll need a Phillips screwdriver or Phillips bit along with a drill to make some pilot holes for the screws or to use the included screw anchors. 
To install the solar panel to the camera, you'll need to use the included screws to mount the plate to the top. After installing the mounting plate, you can install the second half of the mount and attach the panel to it. Now this process is basically the same to mount the panel separately from the camera. You'll just need to install the mounting plate to a different location and then use the longer screws that are included in order to secure it. The camera can be attached to different surfaces in two different ways using the same mount. You can either install the mount from the back for a wall mounted installation or you can attach it to the top to mount the camera under an eave or under a deck as I did in my case. After the camera is installed, just attach the solar panel plug to the power port and you're done. In the app, you can make adjustments to your notifications, specify what type of motion you want to detect like people, pets, or cars, and even set privacy zones so you don't accidentally record your neighbors. You can also turn on or off AI tracking that lets the camera follow any movement detected from people or vehicles. There's also a solar dashboard that lets you keep tabs on how much power the built-in battery has and to see how much of an impact you've had on the environment by going solar. As for using the camera, you can watch live footage from anywhere in the world, interact with people over two-way audio, turn on the spotlight, review event recordings, and a whole lot more. You can set up camera presets so that way you can quickly move the camera to different positions. There's also an option called round look that will automatically move the camera 360 degrees so that way you can take a look at your whole property without having to hold down the control buttons in the app. You can either have the camera record through the wide angle lens by default and then manually zoom to the telephoto lens when you're viewing a live video or you can use the dual view feature that will let you see both the wide angle lens and the zoom or the telephoto lens at the same time. This is a really nice feature that can come in handy when you're reviewing recorded footage where the camera is tracking a subject with AI. The camera will notify you when different types of events are detected, such as a person, a pet, or a vehicle, which can help you cut down on the number of times you have to review the video footage. To test how good the image quality is, I'm gonna be using this license plate to see how much we can read. First, we'll start out with the wide angle lens and then we transition to the 8X hybrid zoom lens. And as you can see here, you can read the license plate clearly and I'm standing at about 25 feet away from the camera. Next, I move back to 40 feet and again, you can read the license plate easily from this distance as well. Having both lenses is a great way to see the big picture while still being able to capture the small details like license plate numbers at the same time. The camera has standard infrared night vision and it can even pick up color in really low light situations. Some other things that I want to mention is the camera seems to be built really well and I wouldn't have any hesitation about mounting this outside in an area that's exposed to different weather conditions. In my experience, the AI tracking feature is accurate and you can also control how fast or how slow the camera will move to follow subjects inside of the app. To me, the combination of the dual lenses, pan tilt zoom features, AI tracking, and flexibility for the installation is really good, especially if you want a hassle-free and completely wireless solution. So if you want to pick up a Eufy Security S340, I'll have a link in the video description so you can find one at the best price. And if you want even more AI features in a compact design that's still solar powered, check out my review video on the Eufy Security S330 next. All right, thanks for watching this video and I will see you in the next one.